Hi guys, it's Minx here, back with one of my exciting story time videos, and I have a wild fucking story to share with you guys today. I was almost kidnapped. Yes, you read the title below the video. You're sitting there, grasping the size of your seat. You're so excited, you can't wait to hear the terrible, traumatic experience that happened to me. So, I'm gonna tell you, before I do guys, Moment to hit the thumbs up button. Let's aim for 70 million likes on this video. If you don't, I'll cry. The world will cry. If, if you don't like the video, a puppy will essentially die somewhere in the world if you don't hit the like button. So just do that. That's more important than anything I'm about to say. So just remember to do that. Thanks. Anyway, moving into my horrific kidnap ordeal. So um, I was getting a cab getting a cab to an airport and um, I called up the cab company everything seemed fine very nice polite on the phone wouldn't suspect the horror that was going to occur shortly in my future the cab comes up I get inside the guy's like the airport I'm, yeah then I head over to the airport and we're driving along everything seems normal I look up the cab driver you know, he's uh, glancing at his uh, hands-free phone occasionally. He's uh, driving a little bit fast, but, you know, all cab drivers do, in my opinion, for the most part. And we're making good time to the airport. I'm thinking, yeah, yeah, everything looks good. Everything looks good. And then I looked out the window. <sighs> I'm sorry, guys. This is really shaking me up. I looked out the window. And I realised we were taking a slightly different route to the one that I was used to. He could have been taking me anywhere. Okay, he was still heading towards the airport, but he took a different route. He could have been taking me to some crazy dungeon. Some, like, barn in the middle of nowhere where he's going to lock me up. <laughs> I mean, he was taking me to the airport. So, you know, obviously it wasn't actually a kidnap, but it could have been. It, I, for, for a few minutes, I was like, wow. Different route, kidnap, torture. This is the end of the road for me. No more amazing story time YouTube videos for you guys to enjoy. But then uh, we ended up at the airport and I, I got out. I mean, I was shaken up, obviously. I was like, whoa, whoa, whoa. That's the noise I made as I got out of the car. And the, the, the driver was like, that's a bit weird. Are you okay? And I was like, yes, just, just take the money and go. And I threw the money at him. Staggered to the side of the road and I was like, Phew. I just survived a kidnap attempt, almost probably. I have to tell you guys about it. Then I immediately, you know, got out my recording equipment, which we're listening to right now, and recorded the experience. So you guys could, you know, spread the word. Spread the word. So yeah, um, that was my shocking kidnap story. I can't believe, I can't believe it almost totally, nearly, possibly, maybe didn't really happen to me at all. And I think you guys should share this video to spread awareness. And, and to hit that like button, remember? Remember remember those puppies? Remember the fucking puppies? Thank you for watching, everyone. Um, you can follow me on all my social media via the links in the description. And um, remember, 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 remember the fucking puppies, okay? Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye!